and welcome to this is Minecraft Tutorials and today as always we are doing the next part of my Walmart tutorial so let me get this started and we're going to be doing some departments we're going to be doing the uh, TLE we'll get TLE done first and then we'll do the uh, departments so let me get my green out of the way and we'll get started here Hey, what's up, YouTube? In this video, we'll be do I'll be doing the last and the next part of our mic of our Walmart. So, this time we'll be doing the TLE, some of the departments here, and of course, maybe we'll be doing um, other stuff as well. So. Let me get the items that you're going to need here real quick and we'll get started. You're going to need gray concrete. Not terracotta. Gray concrete. Gray concrete. Uh, we're going to need quartz stairs. What's that one you want to use? We're going to need. Uh, we're going to use quartz block. And I'll show you why. Um, we're going to use. Pigs and frames. An iron frame. And a music desk. Okay. So. You're going to come over here to TLE. TLE is this section over here. Yeah, I think this is the only thing that's on mine. So, we're going to come in here, and we're going to remove... Oh! And we need, we need ladders. I'm thinking that might be it. So, you're going to dig out the entire inside of your TLE. I mean the entire inside. <coughs> Excuse me. Show you what we're going to do for the bottom. We're going to place great concrete on the bottom. So you just going to continue doing that until you have the. Except for the parts that we just dug out, we're going to place gray concrete on top. Remember, do not place any we just dug out. You'll see why here. 
Just a second. One more item for the, uh, for the next part, and I'll see what those, what that is. In just a minute. So, we're going to get, also get out some iron bars. In between... Where are you going to go down? To the bottom? Because this is kind of where the technicians go to fix cars. place a ladder. The ladder is going to go all the way down to here. Now, I don't know what's all down here. All I know is this is where the technicians go. I've never been downstairs. I just know that there's a special place for them to go working on the cars. That's all I know. So, if you want, you can place cars here. And you're going to do this to every single hole. Every single hole. This is a lot better because that looks a lot like, like, you know, you look, you go underneath and you see it. Alright, so. Again, I've never been downstairs underneath the TLE. And that's only because, well, obviously, I've never worked in TLE. I don't belong there. I'm a maintenance guy. Right, and place another ladder. And there, perfect. Now. In a few spaces, you can place that 
place a um, an iron frame and a music disc. That kind of looks like a tire, basically. In these places, there's always um, things to put new tires on. I think that's about it for this part. So we're going to close her up. Alright. So. Behind here. We're going to place a couple of. Um. Cast registers. Like right here. Right here. I almost forgot that we need an oak trap door. Oh, that's perfect, actually. And there you go. That is your TLE complete. Now, you can add some more stuff. Um, if you want to, you can actually knock this wall out. But that's going to be where the uh, associate stuff is going to be. Right, we're going to get rid of all these materials. And we're going to work on the electronics. Alright, first of all, what we're going to do... Is we're going to come in here where the phone lab is. We're going to grab quartz stairs. We're going to grab um, quartz block. We're going to grab um, quartz slab. We're going to grab. Glass. Item frames, if I can find them. Jig boxes. Any kind of discs, so we're gonna grab two of them. And else. I think that's about, oh, um, and, uh, we're also gonna grab a bookshelf. Alright, so, right here, we're gonna put one, two, three, let's see, two smooth quartz stairs, the smooth quartz blocks, then place it upside down smooth quartz stairs, and place three behind it, to the right of it, place another upside down quartz stair. Place another one and I forgot to bring out the oak trap door. And place that. Actually we're gonna make that a little bigger. Now that I think about it. Two, three, four. Because we're going to place a little machine behind here um, later on in here in a minute. I'll say how we're going to do that. Yeah, this is a minute. We're going to place a stair here and a stair here. The machine is kind of like a copier machine. I'm gonna place an item frame and one of these. Or, hear me out. There's another option. I'm gonna need paper for this. Or a map, whatever you prefer to use. I'm going to use paper. You can do this and that. And then place that and I frame class in the middle. That looks like a, like, yo, you go over here, you pay for your pictures, and they print them off, basically. Alright. So we're going to get rid of this. That and we're gonna come out here. 
in front of, um, and to the left, right of this entrance goal place, we're going to go count four and three rows in front. One, two, three, place of concrete, or uh, white, a uh, Smooth force block. Place one on top. Place another. Place one on top. Place another. Place one on top. One more. Inside, these are going to be glass pane. These are like your, um, I need a button. I forgot about the button. These are your photo kiosks. Since there's no longer those little, um, and place these here for buttons. One more thing, I forgot one more thing.
Obviously, we need to go back one. We're gonna make only three of these. And to differentiate these from the uh, Xbox ones, we'll place green um, the another set of music discs. This is a PlayStation 4 version. Or this could be Xbox. Alright. And place that around. And we're going to place one more. Behind it. Because we're not going to have enough room <laughs> to place another. We made this a little too small. Okay. Now, we are, however, going to make um, places where you can buy your consoles. We're going to get out. Actually, we can use two boxes for this. Actually, no, we're going to use no blocks. Now, the Switch versions. Switch games are cartridges. So, what we're going to do for those. I'm trying to think. What would make a good cartridge? Man, this piano work. These into end crystals. Place glass in front. Switch games. Now, Walmart has places to buy like consoles and where you can play these consoles. So we're going to place glass here, glass underneath, place item frame. Go place a jukebox. And then again, place it there. Then we're gonna do that again. Perfect. And try to think of how we're gonna make a controller. Because sometimes uh some play some Walmarts actually have the displays where you can play the game. So I'm trying to think. To make the controller. Oh, here we go. So we're gonna use a grindstone. That looks like a controller. You can use whatever you want for the controller. Perfect. And that is so you can play it. And then on top of this. the glass that looks like a what you would call a screen now you don't have to use that you can use this and that just shows you you can play the game so I think that's what we're going to do has one for now they did they don't have a display for switch but we can make it to where you know it can look some some Walmarts have um this is for your to play the switch 
and we'll use two of these because obviously it's gonna have two toy cars. Is that there? Is that there? There we go. There is your um game consoles. Usually to the right on the game consoles are like books you can buy. Uh so we're gonna place a couple of bookshelves. We're also gonna be using bookshelves for like different things. Perfect. Alright. So we got electronics done. Looks pretty cool, huh? Alright. So, now we're going to make the sections of the Walmart. We're going to place rows upon rows of bookshelves. You can place whatever you want to place in there. Now, some Walmarts have fist tanks, and I completely forgot we were going to put some doors in here, too. So hold on just a minute. To the left, for the bookshelves, we're going to place a double door. And a couple of those. Place another double door. <sighs> there. Um, we'll be removing those doors to make the flooring back there. By the way, we're going to stop right there because this over here is for frozen foods. Um, we're going to place a place for other things. All right. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of all of the materials for now. And now we're going to work on making the food section. So, you're going to need some of course blocks. You're going to need stone bricks. You're going to need glass block. You're going to need um, and then you're going to need a stone cutter. And I'll show you why here in a minute. Oh, I can find it. Alright, let's try this. There's a reason why I'm going to get a stone cutter. We're gonna need. I'm trying to think what else we need. We're gonna need. Um, we'll go ahead and get the foods in a little bit. But. Behind here. Oh, we also need doors. So. To the right of here is a walkway. You're going to place a stone brick and count two. And then you're going to place more stone bricks. Uh, about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen of those. You place another double door. Place one. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven of those. Place that again. Place another one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Double door. Place the rest. To the left, you're going to place another double door. To the right, you're going to place another double door. That's going to go to... That's going to go to um, the receiving area. Oh, and before I forget, these are freezers. And refrigerators. I'm going to be placing later. another one <clears throat> to the left of it about five rows now you're not going to place anything inside the doors however these there and I also want to get some oak fence gate because this is where you go to get inside to get stuff for like cakes and stuff I'll be showing you how we're going to do that here in a minute I think we're going to place one more here. I think we're going to move this because um, behind here, right he to the right of here, is going to be like the egg section. And I'll show you how we're going to do that. So we're going to place another door right here. Alright. So, is he's going to build it up to the top. Again, we're going to place some more, um, we're going to place another, uh, section here. Later on, maybe when we get to part six, or in part seven. And, Is going to continue building up. Now, once we get this done, we're also going to be placing. Move! Move!
is your entire section. However, then we're gonna make this a little bigger because, well, obviously, there's a reason why we're gonna make this a little bigger. Um, we're gonna make it bigger because behind here is gonna be a deli section. We can buy all kinds of good uh, meats and stuff. And that is why we got our, our stone cutter. So, coming from this wall here, you're going to count one, two, three, and leave it in the gap of three. We'll place that. Leave this section right here open. So that he can walk in and out. And on top of all this, we're gonna place glass. And don't worry about like um and I think I'm trying to think if that would be good enough. I think we're gonna sort this to about one. Because this is where, you know, they hand out this stuff. And I think... I was going to put it down to you. Behind here? And we need a, um... Cauldron. Too, I forgot about the cauldron. Because we need a cauldron. Too, because... Behind here? Are fires. So you're gonna place... One two, three of those. And on top, place a stone cutter. That kind of looks like you can put your meat on there and slice it up. Ooh. We're getting there, people. We're getting there. We're going to get rid of all that. Hey, Sonny. What's up? Now that we got that taken care of, we're going to grab some new material. We're going to grab bookshelves. We're going to grab um, different kinds of banners, whatever you prefer. We're going to grab boots. We're going to grab boots. We're going to grab armor. Uh, you guys can choose whichever armor you want. I'm going to be choosing that here in a minute. We're going to be using the armor to make our um, clothing. We're going to use this. And before you say, oh, are we going to be using armor stands? No, we're gonna be using um so we're going for starts. We're gonna use test plates for teens. Um we're gonna use two kinds of them. It's white and blue. And I think that's about it. So coming from this section here, you're gonna place you're going to leave a gap of two, and you're going to place one, two, three, four, five bookshelves. Put, place the bookshelves on top. All the way. Leave a gap of two. Place more goods, bookshelves to the top. And you're going to do that every single time. So gap of two, bookshelves. Gap two, book cells. Gap two, book cells. And yes, I know there's doors right here, but that's okay. Gap two, book cells. Gap two, book cells. I might move those later on. Gap two, book cells. Gap two, book cells. You get the idea. Book cells. Book cells. Bookshelves. 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 And one more. These are like 
buy, you, you give, get stuff off of, basically. Originally, when I started making Walmart, uh, to, uh, Walmart builds, I would use regular, regular, um, oak tap doors. But, instead of doing that, we'll just place bookshelves. And you can place whatever you want on them. Ideas are endless. And then also we're going to be making the, um, the freezers and stuff, which I'll do to, as soon as we get done with the clothing, uh, section. I'm also going to placing some more shelves, um, right in front of the clothing section. Now you don't have to uh, use this bookshelves either. Um, can you use other things? Let's go to make, making a DVD slash CD center. Go in front of the electronics. Perfect. Alright. So now we're going to work on the clothing slash baby section. So, coming from um this one right here, we're going to place one, two, three, four, five, six. We're going to build it up. And then, leave a gap of two. Two, oop, two three, four, five. to 
this, I'm gonna call it quits. We've been on for at least 40 minutes, so. And we'll work on the uh, clothing section, but. So now that we got those out of the way, we're going to toss them away, and we're going to grab our book cells, we're going to grab our I didn't mean to put that on, and our team mail. <laughs> okay. So. Oh yeah, we need boots. We need boots! We need boots. Because we can't have a Sue section without boots. Where are the boots? These will look these are like for your shoes. So we're gonna grab blue shoes and chain boots. Okay, so on this little place, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And you're gonna place these on top. I'm going to place one more row. In front. Hey, Rasher. And you're going to do this to every single row. Try a suit. 
is on there, basically. Now, if you want, you can use different uh, colored ones. Um, we can use like weather ones. I don't know. You might want to use other kinds of uh, armor. into a clothing.
you know what else we got? We want to make a fitting room. A couple of them. So it's a good thing I didn't fill those up just yet. We're just going to place them around here. So. Just a minute, guys. I'm gonna make this a little bigger, actually. Just a little bit. So we're gonna take this door and move it here. door and move it here. <laughs> Crazy cat. And then perfect. Okay, so I'm gonna
I say? Let's see here. Press two there. And uh, you might want to place something to kind of look to make it very clear to see inside. So I'm thinking maybe a beacon. Section, but we'll also go make one for the um dang I keep forgetting the name of it. The uh Dang I keep forgetting the name of it Fitting Room So we're gonna need Loom Bray Banner White Dye Blue dye, brown dye. Alright. Take care. Oh, hang on. We need more than one. Uh, 
light gray banner. So, take your light gray banner and place your white dye in. Yeah, yeah that, that looks about right. And you place your white uh, take out of uh, the thing. Take your white dye out, put your blue dye in with that. And there's that. Last but not least, take your blue dye out, put your bottom dye in, and you're going to make a fade. And there is your um, mirror. So the mirrors are going to go inside the pretty rooms. Like so. That way you can look, you know, you can look in the mirror and say, oh, I look good in these.
think that maybe we'll place a couple more. But you get the idea, basically. And we're going to place some more, maybe right here. space is empty. And these can be like, I don't know, maybe you can put like condiments and stuff in there. stuff in here too so you guys can figure out what you want to do with these. I'm going to probably just leave them there but again you guys can do whatever you want with these. Whew. We got a lot of space. Kind of hard to figure out what you want to put what you want to put there. You know? It really is. It's like, oh, what do I want to put here? What do I want to put here? What do I want to put here? Yeah? You know? And then, I think we're going to place the toy uh, section over there later. We're going to place um, all the... Uh, freezers and stuff over here so I think that's probably about it for the sixth part of the tutorial um, again we got a lot of ground to work on I'll be doing that tomorrow hopefully we will finish up with this entire tutorial anyway as always if you on YouTube, like, comment, subscribe, share, uh, hit the notification bell to make sure you know I'm notified when I have a brand new video up. We have quite, I have quite a few tutorials on other builds. Uh, we're going to be, we're still working on uh, building this entire super center of Walmart. But yeah, I think that's about it for this part of the build. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Tomorrow, we will finish this up, or maybe Sunday. Um, we're having a festival this weekend, so I'm not sure if we'll be doing it tomorrow or not. But we'll see. Anyway, and if you are on Twitch, if you have not followed me, be sure to follow if you want. I do all kinds of cool things. Anyway, I'll see you guys on the next episode where we'll be finishing up the inside of our Walmart. And we'll be working on the front. I guess too. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.